September 1, 2017, 0959 Rugby Union Saracens can wrestle the trophy off Exeter Saracens may have missed out on a third successive Aviva Premiership title last season, but our Steve Bramley expects them to deliver profits this term. Last season one tipped Saracens to top the regular season and they let me down badly as Exeter Chiefs surprised everyone by claiming their first Aviva Premiership title. There was every reason to think that Mark McCall's side, fresh from winning a first league and European Cup double, were the safest of bets to clinch a third successive Premiership title. But IDIDNT account for little old Exeter a record point scorer's Wasps, who dominated the league campaign and then went on to fight it out in a thrilling grand final, Gareth Steenson's dramatic extra-time penalty securing the West Country side a first title. Saracens finished third after the Chiefs snatched a late win in the playoff semi-final, but they did regroup and go on and retain the European crown in style at Murrayfield, so in truth it was still a pretty good season for the men in black. Twelve months on and I'm more certain than ever that this year the European Cup holders will bounce back in style and re-establish themselves as the best team in the English game and repay my faith at 17-10 general. Their failure on the domestic front last season they finished seven points adrift of Wasps and Exeter must really have grated them and that can only be worrying for their title rivals this time around. McCall has bolstered the club squad depth in the summer months to help cover for the inevitable losses during the international fixtures, which was probably the key reason to them missing out last season, and now has probably the biggest and most talented squads in the Premiership. France international hooker Christopher Tolofua and Australian test lock Will Skelton have been added to the ranks, while Liam Williams, one of the outstanding players during the British and Irish Lions' successful tour of New Zealand, looks a perfect replacement for Chris Ashton who has moved to Toulon. Free-scoring Wasps, 52 general to win the regular season, will again push Saracens all the way, but as last season, I expect things to end in disappointment for Di Young's men. Exeter 2017 Aviva Premiership Champions Exeter were around 61 shots to win the title last season. This time around they are best price 72 general but despite their remarkable achievements last season can they reach such great heights again, I seriously doubt it. Leicester Tigers reached the playoffs last season but like Saracens were denied by a late try as Wasps booked their place at Twickenham. The return of England fly half George Ford to Welford Road and wing Johnny May has shown their desire but a top four finish is the best they can hope for. So it's Saracens to win the regular season and Skybet also have them chalked up at 114, as one of their request abbeys, to go on and win the playoff final and I'm more than confident they will deliver a healthy profit this time around. With Saracens my strong fancies for the title, I have a similar feeling about the foot of the table with newly promoted London Irish Odson 45 general to make an immediate return to the championship. Worcester Warriors, who are best priced 21 to finish bottom, have become battle-hardened when it comes to relegation dogfights. They outgunned Irish two years ago to survive and last season finished 13 points clear of relegated Bristol. Experience in these situations is Key and Worcester know what is needed to avoid the trapdoor. Recommended bets of Eva Premiership 2 PTS Saracens to top the regular season and win the grand final at 114 Sky Bet. Saris will be more determined than ever to make up for last season's disappointment on the domestic front. 3 PTS Saracens to win the regular season at 17 10 general winner in two of the last three seasons and now have a stronger squad to cope with the rigours of a 22 match league campaign. 2 PTS London Irish to finish bottom at 45 general. Irish have recruited well but as Bristol found last season but the step up is too big to bridge click here for our transparent tipping record. Posted 1045 BST 010917 related links Premiership Lowdown Exeter Odson to make his story check out the latest NAP selection from our flagship racing tips to Benlin for Friday's tip goes for David O'Meara at Thursk. Anita Chambers provides a selection for every race on Friday, with Robin Weathers fancy to strike for William Haggers at Sandown. Each Friday our racing team will be trying to hit a multiple racing bet out of the ballpark and this weekend features two Mark Johnston runners at Chester. Next race off 12.15 Fairview Vanilla Rose Liam Tarantel Bengal Tiger Jar Danielson th Best bet on Malta v England lies in the bookings markets, says Andy Schooler, who's also got a 152 tip in the Northern Ireland clash. Nick Hex thinks Peterborough have to be back to 135 to make it 5 Sky Bet League 1 in a row to start the season.
David John says Spain's Marco Asensio is the player to focus on from Saturday night's World Cup qualifying action in Europe.